Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome again to the Middle Sphere. In this video, we'll be looking at Zeta Chain XP. And this Zeta XP is a way of you interacting with the Zeta ecosystem and earning some points. Now, is there an opportunity for us to position for a second Zeta Chain airdrop? We are going to be looking into that in this video. Now, many people missed out on the Zeta Chain, the first testnet interaction, which rewarded many users for it about $200 and above to like $32,000. $36,000 depending on how interactive you are and in how much people you referred and Zeta Chain is one of the zero to five thousand dollar challenge uh you know airdrop that we're doing right in this video we are going to be looking at the second one which is going to be for us to interact with the mainnet now on the first one we did uh, this test net phase we accumulated points and if you had about 50,000 points accumulated you will be eligible for the airdrop but if you had less you will not qualify for it so it doesn't matter if you did it tested if you have less than 50k points you are not going to be part of those who are shared in the airdrop let's look at how we can get on board with this and it's pretty much easy when you're done claiming your tokens all you have to do is to come here and get started so if you're new to the middle sphere please hit the subscribe button and also turn on the description icon to get notified every time we release a new video we break down web3 activities for you to make them simple for anyone to be able to get on board with and we also talk about the financial market so we will run our videos for all that soon if you want to be part of our community we have links in the description of the video you can join and you can have all this information sent to you directly as soon as we get them now let's get into zeta hub and let's quickly break down what we're looking at for you to be part of this even if you've not connected before if you've connected before uh, all you have to do is to come here and connect your wallet you can click on metamax or okx anyone that you feel okay with and it's going to prompt you to go and sign in but i've already signed in on my metamax so it's just a straight connection so you wait for it to load out your page and bring out all the information concerning your own wallet address and just a little bit of you know tip for you if you are trying to do this and you've not done uh, zeta testnet before please connect the wallet that you've done a lot of ethereum transaction on because i think that also counted as one of the multipliers for you having more tokens so many people got less token than they should have because they connected their bona wallets which you've not really done any transaction on so make sure you use a wallet that you've done a lot of ethereum transaction on mainnet transactions it will boost in helping you so now let's look at it's at the hub so as you can see to my right here we have a leaderboard and you can see a lot of people have accumulated points 57.5 xp being the highest and right here you can see my own points that have been given to me i'm in level one and one of the mistakes i did was when i signed up first i did not claim my xps when I did the transactions that day, I left them. I thought it to automatically credit itself, but that's not what will happen. You have to claim your points every day. Just a little small transaction. It doesn't, the gas fee on Zeta is very, very, very cheap. So let's go to what we have on the left here. And on my left here, you can see we have earn XP and we have transactions. We have pool, we have stake, we have send, we have governance, trade, claim. And if you go down a little bit, you'll see something like ecosystem, support, and community. Now, we're going to talk about all this, but let's look at the activities that can earn you point, uh, XPs. One of the first activity here is for you to send Zeta in Zeta Chain. So you can send to a friend, you're going to earn 2,500 XP. You can also receive Zeta in Zeta Chain and then you earn 1,000. Then you're going to be a liquidity provider to any core pool and you get 5,000 then also you can invite a friend invite 10 friends invite 50 friends enroll in zeta xp and then receive btc in zeta chain you can also receive it in zeta chain and also receive bnb in zeta chain so for these three right here there's a different way for you to do this i think you're going to be using an, another dap that's on the ecosystem a lot of people are talking about using izumi but uh i've not really interacted with this so i can't really show you how uh, that is done until i have full information on how we can do that through izumi and then we can be able to claim our points 2500 points each for all these ones so but the easiest ones for you to do is for you to just send a transaction you can send to your friend or if you have another wallet you can send to that wallet and you know just send back to yourself again and then you'll be able to claim the xp points so every time you're done sending your uh getting a transaction you're going to see claim xp point here so you're just going to go there and you're going to click this so let me try make a transaction and if you don't if you want to get started on this if you didn't make the airdrop all you have to do is to go and buy a zeta it's about 1.6 1.5 dollars for one zeta right now so you can buy like five or you can buy like 10 depending on how much you have uh you can even buy 50 or 100 if you if you are good for it then you come all the way here and you can start transacting doing all this let me just do a transaction with my metamax so what i'll be doing is i'll be sending one zeta to this address and the transaction is pretty much fast. I have sent one Zeta to this address. 
So after sending, you wait for a minute for the, and now you can see right here, it just says send Zeta in Zeta chain, 2005 XP. I'm just going to come down here and you see that it has given me the claim XP. So you're going to click on this claim XP, then sign. Okay. So now you can see that it has claimed my XP for me at the bottom right here. It has changed to 7K. If I come up at the top here, you can see it has changed to 7K XP. And that's how you will be doing this every day. It's going to last for 30 days. So I think the first of March or the second of March is going to be ending. This leaderboard also, how much you transact on it will, you know, determine what your final point is. You may get rewarded some tokens. I, we don't know yet, but this is what uh, the things you can do. On Zeta Hub, you can track your transactions. So if I come right to the bottom here, you can see my transactions. I don't know if this is really displaying yet because this is pretty much still very early. So they're having one or two bugs with the, with the page, but you can track your transactions right here. And also, if you want to be part of the pool, you can click on the pool and provide liquidity for Zeta and Ethereum if you have it into this pool and you're going to be qualifying for one of the criteria for to claim XP points or you can pick Zeta chain and BNB so you have to get some BNB and you provide some Zeta for that then also you can go to Zeta chain and BTC and provide also for that you can go to stake here yeah, where you can stake some of your zeta if you have maybe like five or ten depending on what you want uh what you can stake then you stake that with any one of these validators right here and you'll be earning on what you staked now send is where you can send from one from your zeta chain to your own self is to it's still your address that will be given to you but to a different network so you can send zeta in a different network you can send it in the bsc network ethereum network and bitcoin that's pretty much what we did in the test net so you can also have the governance which you participate in governance right here and you can you can, from what you can see that chain is a governance token also so you can participate in governance right here and then you know you can go to trade and when you go to trade, it's going to tell you where you can get Zeta from. So the centralized exchange is where Zeta is trading. We have Bybit, we have OKX, BitGet, Coinbase, KuCoin, and get the IO. On the centralized exchanges, you can get it on Eddy Finance. You can also get it on Zeta Swap, Uniswap, Izumi right here. So if we click on Izumi, it's going to take us, we're going to leave here and I'll wait for that page to load out. But while Izumi is loading, let's look at how we can, you know, the main things that are here. So that is for trade and then claim is where you claim your airdrop the ecosystem now so let's click on ecosystem and it's going to bring out all the dApps that are connected to the zeta chain ecosystem so it's it will be cool for you to you know explore all this on mainnet because they can also have these protocols and these dApps here can decide to start giving their own airdrop for those who tra all transacted on them i think izumi has loaded so you can see i'm currently connected to izumi and i have some zeta here what i want to do is you can buy you can bridge here you can do a lot of things here you can swap look at that so if i click on swap i can swap my zeta to usdt here which is pretty much easy you can see here we have the zeta token that i have left in my wallet i can swap it to bs to bnb in zeta why don't i even try do this let me try to do this so right now on izumi i can just put one zeta and i'll move it to bnb so you can see how much it is currently so let me click on swap all right so i'm just going to click on this okay so my swap has been successfully done and you can see i've successfully swapped one zeta to bsc to bnb bsc which has been done successfully so i'm just going to close here and uh, that is pretty much what you can do on here i can also swap my zeta to bitcoin right there so let me go back to swap and I have Zeta here. So I can just click on here and you can see that I have BTC. So you can swap it to BTC here and provide liquidity on uh, the Zeta hub. So now that I've done this, let me just go back to the page here. So we have the support and all that here. It's just trying to interact with a lot of dApps here from page one to 26. So interact with all those dApps and see you know what you can do. You never know which one can do another airdrop again. But let me just go back to NXP so you can see receive zeta in bnb chain so i've done this right now and i have 2500 so because i swapped on izumi right now i have fulfilled one of the criteria for this so it's not even as difficult as it looks like so i'm going to be claiming the xp for what i just did now sign 
and my points should be successfully claimed right now so let me just refresh the page we can be doing swaps here so i can swap to ETH also let me let me click on this let me make a swap on ETH also so i think i have 1.69 zeta left on my wallet so let me see if i can swap 0.5 okay so this is what i will be receiving here in it so let me click on swap so i'll close this and then let me do the final transaction which is going to be from moving from ETH to btc i'm going to be doing the same amount so let me look at the same amount which is just a few cents in btc so i'm going to approve this transaction also okay so i've successfully swapped the btc and what i'll do is after i'm done with izumi i'm just going to go and go claim all those uh, xp points for all this that i've done here on my zeta hub and that is how everything is that is how you can transact and this is how you can do all the stacks there's still more that you can do just like i showed you in this video just follow everything and you'll be able to get your xp points so you have to do this every day so that's why transacting using the smaller amounts will be better to help you manage what you have well so i'm going to be reloading my account uh, with more zeta just so that i can be able to keep up with this and score a lot of points every day before the end of the whole process you know i don't know what they can incentivize us with but uh, this is how you can interact it also generates a lot of transactions for you on zeta so that is everything for this video so thank you for being here all the way with me if you found value in this video please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel also turn on the notification icon to get notified every time we release a new video if you're interested in learning cryptocurrency, we have our course. It's in the description of this video. You can go click on it and start and you'll be able to understand how all these things are done. Pretty much easy and straightforward. It's also going to set you on a path for positioning yourself better information-wise for the bull run. Thank you for being here all the way with me and I'll see you in the next one.